We've all seen this cross-section before. It represents an airplane wing, an example of an airfoil. But how does it actually make the air on top of it travel faster than the air below it? To create lift, an airplane wing needs to generate a pressure difference, low pressure above the wing and higher pressure below it. The shape of the wing with its curved top and flatter bottom is key to achieving this. As air flows over the curved top, it follows the surface and accelerates, thanks to the wing's shape and the way air behaves around curves. This faster moving air creates an area of low pressure above the wing. Meanwhile, air flowing below the wing also speeds up, but not as much, because this surface is flatter and the path shorter. Together, the faster air above and slower air below create the pressure difference needed for lift, and by tilting the wing, its angle of attack, the airflow is deflected downward, further contributing to the upward force that keeps the plane in the sky.